Hey, how you doing? I thought today I'd talk a little bit about cameras. Now, when we're shooting video for classes or lectures or seminars that we're going to use in the future, it's natural to wonder, well, what kind of camera should I use? And <laughs> gracious, you know, there's no end to the amount of money that you could spend on a camera. But one thing I wanted to propose to you today is you actually have a pretty darn good camera right there in your pocket. I'm shooting this right now on my cell phone, and it's not bad. Now, yes, the resolution could be a little bit better, and I could have better depth of field with a professional camera, and the sound is not the best on the planet. But considering I'm using something that I already own and have not spent a single penny on to make this video, that's not bad. Now, the way that I've set this up for this particular video is that I've put it inside of a ring light. So if we look right over there, we can see that I have this white ring light all set up, and then I have a mount that sets the camera right in the middle. That way, I am well lit. Now, you also notice that since I wear glasses, that means I've got, yeah, check it out, I've got that reflection going on. Now, if you don't wear glasses, that's not a big deal. But, yeah, if you do, then that's something that's going to come up. Now, you could always, so, you know, always kind of try to look down and so forth, but that's a bother. What it simply means is that your viewer is going to get have to get used to the idea of having that reflection. But that's a small price to pay for a pretty basic setup. Now, what if you don't have a ring light? I mean, this isn't bad, right? And these ring lights aren't heinously expensive, but they do cost money. What are your options then? So here we are once again shooting with our camera, but no ring light this time. So, where am I getting my light? Well, from this window. And you notice, I don't have the phone set on a tripod or anything. I've taped it to the window. Yeah, it's that simple. Just some nice masking tape. Nice masking tape. What am I talking about? Some basic painter's tape. I throw that up, and lo and behold, my camera is all set up, and I'm good to go. This way you have some nice natural light that you can use to shoot your videos. One of the things we're going to learn as we go about these uh, kind of tech videos is light means a lot. And so anytime that you can kind of get some good, simple, natural lighting, that's something you want to take advantage of. So there are some options for you and pretty good options considering they're using equipment that you already have available for the most part. However, I would like to call out the elephant in the room, and that is the sound. Let's face it, the microphone on the camera doesn't really deliver the very best sound, and so in this case, I'm using a separate microphone. And that's something you may want to consider doing in the future as well. In upcoming videos, I will talk about microphone options, how to use them, the best conditions in which to use them, and of course, we're always going to look out after cost because we don't necessarily want to break the bank to deliver these videos. All right, so I hope this was helpful. Uh, stick around. We've got more coming, and until then, have a fantastic day.